Hi guys, it's Sarah from Arlene's. Today I wanted to show you what it's like to open one of our new watercolor field travel sets. This one happens to be $19.99. It comes with 48 colors. I thought it was cute because it had so many colors and it's not too overwhelming and it's not very expensive. It also comes with a water brush that you can fill with water. So today I'm gonna to show you what that looks like. I already put water in my water brush that's in the palette. This one is cute because it has a little thumb hole, so you could hold it if you're standing at an easel or a desk. And then you just open the lid. It has two mixing trays. This one happens to pop out, so you can attach it to the end if you want. There's like some little holes there. This is the water brush. So basically you just fill this with water. It has a cap and it has a plastic tip that you can use as a paintbrush if you're on the go. You don't want to use a jar of water or you just want to be really simple and play around with watercolor. So you can attach this here. There's like little holes and you can have an extra mixing area. Let's try it out. So let's start with a nice pretty blue color. So I'm going to squeeze this to activate it by allowing the water to flow into the palette. And then this is a dry piece of watercolor paper, just 140 pound cold press. So I'm just going to show you how vibrant that is. And if I squeeze this, it adds water so you can do some more blending to activate the watercolor on the paper. So we're just going to do like a really basic sky. Or you could even flip it around and make that the water. Let's do that because then we can put like a little boat in there. But first I'm going to get some yellow and I'm going to put like a little sun here because why not? It's fun. We're just playing around. Do you remember doing this when you were little? <laughs> it's so fun. I highly recommend this just because there's no pressure. It has like a little sponge right there that you can like dab off the water brush. And then let's pick a red for the boat. So you can just do like a really fun boat with a sail. And then maybe make the reflection go down into the water. I know this is so like kid-like, but it's so much fun. I hope that you want to come and check it out. We have so many field sets like this, and we have lots of individual water brushes of different shapes and sizes. So you could pick what works for you. Have a great day.